<laughs> All right. So you, you, um, call your, well, the definition, you're the definition of an independent hip hop artist and you do it all. You rap, you produce, you engineer, and you book your own shows. Like, um, just talk about, you know, having that mentality. Like, is it, is it the way you prefer to m maneuver as far as, uh, trusting yourself to get something done before others? It, it It is that now, but what even started all this is because, well, like, look, when I started, when I started rapping, of course, like, the first thing you're looking for is, like, validation, like, validation anywhere where you can find it, like, find somebody that tells you that they like what you're doing, they kind of build your right. confidence. And like, it, it's an actual human thing, like, it's not what I encourage for people, but naturally, when you start something, you're not confident in it. You're looking for that validation. So when I was uh, when I, I wanted I wanted to find ways to get on mic and get and get heard by people, and and like it got to the point to where I was just real, almost like found myself begging for these opportunities. So then I just got to where I was like, I'm gonna put on my own show. Like, and that's where me and the people I was around at the time was like, let's do our own show. Especially when me and Case got tighter, like 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 when me and Case got tighter to a point, we were like really like tight. Um, and, and Case Jaffa, like Van Guns, mm -hmm. Beats, um, like we we really together probably embodied this mentality of like, well, if people ain't gonna book us, let's book our own shows. Like and even like Beats, I couldn't get I can't get nobody to hit me with a beat to save me. Like like. Beats are around a lot more now than they were back when I started rap because, you know, like I first started pinning back in 97, late 96. And, and like, and so like, like a year after I started writing, I start like, like during that whole year leading up to when I started making beats, it was because like I was rapping on instrumentals, but like, we was always like, man, we really like want our own thing. And nobody was like really trying to like hit us with no beats or nothing. Like the beat game was just different then too. So it was like people just had their beats and be really closed in about them. It wasn't you couldn't even you couldn't go on no beat stars and no sound click or none of that and even buy a beat then the way that you can now like like in this in this internet world. So really, all this stuff came about from having to like the necessity of being able to, to, to make it available to self without having to go and, and, and beg people for stuff no more. So, I mean, that's when I started making beats, even now the engineering, like dudes was ripping me off in the studio when I was a youngin and I wasn't getting a proper product. That's why I had to learn how to engineer. Like, like everything came from people short right. me. <laughs> and so, and so I had, I just had, I had, I, I got put in the position where I had to learn this stuff. But I mean, it's, <laughs> it's become fruitful for you as a result of that and kind of being ahead of the game because now it is, um, sort of praise to sort of know how to do it all and, uh, be in control of your own product. 